Kamaga. Two spire, Bravalum, Kuard, Kriya, Hortan, Ara, Nua, Asavet Kappa, and Enroll Nua. Tashi Sun, Suk Dumsa, Nia Wan, Mark Lasik, Mokulaka, Eshkin, Sarol Shin, Fresh, and Mark Gail, Wilbert Ara, Sarain, Will Taki, and Chang, and Leraha, Aka Gakil, Jesh, Kadisha, Sukwim, Gakra, or Vor Ibra, and Machansha. Um, I'm mindful of the short time available, so I'm going to jump right into the revised estimates as they presented. And if I may, Cahirlach, I'd, I'd like to put my questions in two parts in order to allow the, the relevant ministers a uh, chance to answer. Uh, my first questions pertain to the equality budgeting, as outlined on page three of the estimates. Under the last programme for government, a pilot programme on equality budgeting was rolled out across a number of government departments in Budget 2018. Um, the equality budgeting objectives and performance indicators that are outlined in the revised estimates raise a few questions, not just in the attention to increase female participation in film and screen content supported by Fish Aaron, but also on the future of equality budgeting, its success and whether we can improve on efforts made so far. So in considering these issues, I would like to ask the Minister, what is the status of the pilot programme? which sets out to improve equality across government departments, and when is the proposed time frame for its completion? Um, will the department report on lessons learned from the pilot programme on equality budgeting to inform and improve equality budgeting across government departments in the coming years? And has the department considered following up or implementing the recommendations by the OECD review of Ireland's equality budgeting? And I suppose in specific relation to the targets identified in the revised estimate, which state increasing the level of applications uh, received with female talent and increasing the level of successful applications received with female talent by 5% respectively. Uh, can you give us an indication of what the starting point or the baseline for those targets were and whether there was an, a financial underpinning of those targets? And I'll, I'll ask the Minister to respond to that, please. On Tara. Thank you, and indeed, thank you to, to all deputies uh, who have expressed their good wishes to myself um, and uh, Minister Cleary. And I look forward to, to working with you all. Um, I, I might take your three questions together. So, um, while the, the Department for um, Public Expenditure and Reform is responsible for the Equality Budget Programme, my department was one of six government departments which participated in DPRS Equality Budgeting Pilot in 2018. Dedicated uh, equality indicators were included in the 2018 REV with the objective to work to achieve enhanced levels of representation of women and girls in films and screen content supported by the Irish Film Board. Um, equality budgeting uses impact indicators to provide information on how the allocation of resources impacts different groups in society, for example, women, children, disadvantaged groups. While the pilot scheme focused mainly on gender, with five gender objectives and one socioeconomic objective in 2018, the scope was broadened in 2019 to include other equality measures such as poverty, promotion inclusiveness and disability. My department has and will continue to engage with this process annually. An equality budgeting advisory group has been established by DPER to support this process. Um, however, my department is not a member of this group. I'm very supportive of equality budgeting as a means of advancing equality, reducing poverty and strengthening economic and social rights. Uh, in relation to the pilot programme, a key lesson for my department was the value in setting metrics as a means of driving policy change. For example, in 2018, the Irish Film Board of Screen Ireland, as it is now renamed, launched a new scheme called POV, which is aimed at de delivering uh, on Screen Ireland's commitment to achieve 50-50 gender parity with the Irish screen industries, both in front of and behind the camera. Screen Ireland offered enhanced production funding for female-initiated and driven feature films. Screen Ireland surpassed their 2018 equality budgeting targets of 5%, achieving an increase in, of 12% in the level of applications with female talented attached and an increase of 7% in successful um, applications with talent attached. Equality budgeting provides an objective way to track and measure success in this area. A key learning for participation in the pilot was that linking funding uh, decisions to greater gender equality has paid dividends in terms of encouraging greater equality in the film industry and provides a positive model to replicate in other policy areas. 
Um, Screen Ireland is confident that 2020 will build on the success of 2018 and 2019 in terms of the participation of women in screen productions. It is my strong belief that extending equality budgeting to other policy areas in my department will incentivise and reward positive change towards greater equality and I will look to expand this success into other areas in the department. Um, in relation to your third question, my department is very cognizant of the recommendations contained in the OECD report on equality budgeting. While the report recognises that equality budgeting in Ireland is in its infancy, I am pleased that my department has participated in Ireland's initiative since its inception. In recent years, my department and its bodies have engaged in a number of initiatives to promote inclusion and equality in relation to gender participation in the arts and culture sector. This work has involved staff in the culture division and corporate division and external staff and agencies under the department's remit working together to achieve gender balance on state boards in the arts and culture section, uh, sector, which I am pleased to say currently stands at 48, 49%. The project focused on support for women at senior level in arts organisations, support for promotion to the public of the, uh, the work for women artists, leadership in dealing with accusations of abuse of power and sexual harassment in sections of the arts sector, diversity and equality training for boards and senior management of state agencies in the sector. This work was the subject of a civil service excellence and innovation award in 2019. My department will continue to focus on equality when developing policy and will be proactive to ensure that our strategic objectives underpin equality of opportunity, access and outcomes in the arts for all living in Ireland. Thank you very much. Uh, what further speakers have we? Oh, sorry, Deputy. Yeah, talk about that. Well, no, my girl, I'm fucky gum. Niaku me who who says that? Yeah, shinkyakalor. I will not make a chance. No, Elm, I get on Tara Cleary, Fragger, a horde dumps a better go. Go make sure now. Fragra, uh, Scrifa, a uh, Hortum. Um, so, uh, Tom McCoyne, for you, my drug knew it at all, uh, last dig, then uh, the master, uh, master con show, for you, ever the will digitach at all, like he mach and show, the truck a hand keen, Lewis and Marsbrook, um, Don Blaine show, um, and Ara and Will Meader and Drow Cart con on Sprook Shin, a bunch of mach, um, on Blaine show, August Evinisha on Medu, Olvor Keen Ibra, a Totteresh Tarlu, the Devar and Garkham Slaw to Covid and Adiog. Uh, August Nigelton is the Tosa Clare Realtor, so have Keen Ibra. Um, on some we know he gone Ryan Ernest uh, Sprucken and Nice Ulvini, the Mill Digitaka Curl Lawher, a Mach and Shell. August, um, August Midic Plan Oil, a uh, Kainoid Gadira, a Meg, the Mill Digitaka Shell Lonaha, and Will Midic Kintigo will uh, Trolley into Own, Unsk Meg, um, Imana, O have Sprucken Ash Dirti, August O have Plan Oil Stratish, that August Fad Termach. Our counter Gweltach to freshen my hample and make sure uh, Congrat to serve Ishi or Chul Kosalula Scullin and the Shuppi Kumale Naskin, of course, Umper Publi Lashdig and Gweltach August Arrig uh, Gobalti serve Ishi Gwelga Gahire Hatan Telmish Digs Obeder Gokurg to him um, and Fragger.